Hey everybody, Hank Harris here. Welcome back to the Long Dark Stalker Custom, Season 1, Episode 42. We are here at the camp office, Mystery Lake, and we have ourselves our bearskin coat, which needs repaired. However, I want to read these books first, but before I can do that, I'm going to get too thirsty to really do much. Um, I don't have much water left. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to read while I can. I'm going to eat something here. Hmm. Let's eat a couple. Oh, we got some candy bars. Yeah, let's eat those. That'll be good. Shouldn't kill us too much with the old. Uh... Let's do two candy bars. And we'll see if we can. Well, let's go ahead and drink what we got left of the water there. And then let's get some studying done before nightfall hits. So I have two of these sewing primers. I want to level up at least one level before I try to repair the coat, just so I have a better chance of doing it, rather than wasting the entire bear hide, because if you fail, that's it. Bear hide's gone. So let's do one hour here, see how things go. I think I need to lay down. Uh, not yet, hopefully we can do one more. Let's try to do one more. Can she do it? Ooh, it's gonna be close, it's gonna be close. Yep, I wasn't sure which was gonna be first, falling asleep or getting fatigued, too fatigued to focus or not being able to see due to the uh, sun going down, but all right. So we got two of those. We need more water, though. And I looked. I remember looking around here and not see. I didn't see any. So we're gonna boil up some water. Got a couple pots upstairs. So ooh, it's not bad out here actually. Sort of pleasant. All right. This pack is getting Six of those and don't we'll get a. Grab a handful of these sticks. That should be plenty. All right, and I think for dinner, instead of having... I guess we could just eat our consumables. But you know what I think we're going to do? I think we're going to have ourselves a, a bear steak here. Yeah, 1035. We'll take that for now. We'll eat that just before we go to bed. We don't need to be full of calories while we're just sitting there watching water boil. I could study if I put some calories on board, but I'm so tired at this point. Um, Anything right about now. Even if I put food in my stomach so that I could study, um, I, I'm going to end up getting too tired. And then I end up having to rest while I'm trying to boil water. It's just a mess. So I'm just going to focus on boiling water right now rather than trying to do too much multitasking and messing everything up. I don't have that much confidence in my skills to do that yeah all right well we got the fishing book and the fire starter. i think we're pretty good at fire starting i don't think we really need much help there we could probably almost skip that book oh we need to refill our lantern we'll do that while we uh are waiting for the water to boil so let's go ahead and fire up this torch here with the uh the matches and then we will use said torch to start the fire make sure you don't accidentally i do this all the time start fire and it starts using the fire striker even though you got the lit torch sitting right there in your hand and you just basically undid all the brilliant moves you made up until then so yeah we're going to use this torch if we fail we can still use the torch again we don't have to relight it or anything like that one mat and it's guaranteed to light every time with the uh wow, that didn't work yep see so we don't have to relight it so we get another as long as it doesn't run out of you know like dwindle down to zero condition and go out, like burn itself out. We get multiple attempts. Come on, little fire. But it's Come it on. one one match to light the torch is hundred percent guarantee to light every time. So if your skill's really low, this is definitely the way to do it. Once your skill gets up a little higher, not that big a deal, but it could still save you a match or two every so often. So let's get some cedar wood in here. Eh, six hours seems like a pretty good amount of burn time. I think we should be able to get probably, what, two liters. Well, let me do some crazy, silly cop math here. So that's four liters times six. Should we should get 24 liters out of this? No. No, 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 because it takes two hours uh, almost to burn. But then again, I get a little bit of... Uh, because of my skill level, the fire doesn't burn down as fast as it says down there. It's it's different. So I don't know. We're not we're gonna get like maybe 12, 14 liters, I think. I think. Maybe. If we 
cook the entire six hours. All right, so let me see what we got here. I need to find, oh, there's another cooking pot. I could start the fire downstairs too, but I'm just gonna focus on the one upstairs. Not a big deal, it's just one pot down just downstairs. Um, I think that lantern fuel. Is that it? What else did I just take? Ugh, I took something, I don't know what it was. I took something useless and I don't know what it was. Was it a whetstone? I don't think so. I don't think so because it wouldn't have been, it would have been down there. I'm not sure what it was. Oh well. I'll figure it out eventually. Do we have anything else up in here? Oh, there we go. Cherry can. Oh, it's only got 0 0.09 meters. Uh, but we do have a lot of little lantern fuels here. Cool. Let's get our lantern fueled up again. Where's that? There it is. Not harvest. Jeez. Don't do that. Oh, fuel supply. That'll be great. We'll be able to fill it up completely and have a little bit left over. Yeah. Yeah, that's cute. Alright. That's like an adorable amount of leftovers. Where are you at? Where are you at? You're down here somewhere. There it is. Don't need that tin can. Right now, anyway. Um, do I need a whetstone? Uh, 87, 79. Now we're pretty good there. I'm going to put that back. And I will put back that sewing kit. Ooh, it sounds horrible out there. But it's nice and warm and toasty in here. We are doing great, guys. Nothing to worry about here. All right, how are we doing over here? 20 minutes until melted? She's going to get thirsty here soon, isn't she? Yeah. Hungry, thirsty, tired. She's going to be in all kinds of bad moods. All right, let's go ahead and pass time. And we'll pass time here. I want to get a nice big drink. Completely fill up my thirst meter here. There we go. Cook up some more water. She drank a whole two liters right there. She's getting tired. There we go. Let me make sure that that's potable. I'm pretty sure it was. Yes. Yes, it's beautiful clean, delicious water. Yeah, so we're just going to sit here, be hungry, be tired, while this all happens. And we listen to the, the storm. God, I can't eat soon. Three hours and 13 minutes, okay. Oh, that was bad water? Ooh. Huh. I got... I must have left one of these empty or something. I thought I had started both of them, but apparently not. Okay. Whatever. You know what? Let's take that, and I'm going to use some of those purification tablets. I got laying around. I'm going to drop some water here. That'll help definitely make her feel better. There we go. Do I have purification tablets on me? Nah, don't. I think they're downstairs. I don't think they're in here. Let's see them in here. Nah. All right, they must be downstairs in the medical. Then, oh, you know what? Got plenty of lantern now. I don't feel like I need to squander it too much. Light it up for you guys. Checking and making sure my desktop audio is actually being recorded. Unlike the last silent episode. I do apologize for that, guys. What a purification tap. There we go, baby. I don't know how many we need, but I'm going to take them all. Alright, let's see here. I don't think this time lapses, so I don't think we're going to burn this up. I think you just hear it shake or something like, ooh, don't drink that. No, 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 no. Do we have to actually cook on these? I don't use these that much. Yeah, there we go. used one how many how many okay so I did one per liter basically all right. oh right here <laughs> it tells you right here yeah 
words. They have meaning. It's amazing, right? All right. So let's head back up here. You guys want to see what the blizzard looks like? I kind of do. Let's take a little peek outside. Let's just take a peek outside, see what it looks like. See how bad it is. Oh, could you imagine being stuck out in that? Mm -mm, not me. I'm going right back inside. Ah, home sweet home. Don't feel like I'm really squatting either because it's sort of a public building and I pay taxes, so don't really feel like I'm, you know, stealing someone else's property. I want to turn this off since we got this light right here. And it's not it's not the best, but it's not complete darkness, right guys? So I'm gonna get low here and just sort of enjoy the fire. Till melted until melted there. We're back on we're back on schedule. Try. Oh, that's what happened, I think. Yeah. I think that's how I got screwed up last time. Hour and twenty nine. I think we can do this because of my high high level of uh, fire starting skill. I don't think that's a true time right there. We'll see. Let's test this out. for that one. There we go. Let me take a look here. Yeah, I think we're good. And then I'll be happy with what we got here. Perfect. Embers. Perfect. Love it. Alright, great. So I'm going to drop some more water right here. I think this is about... Oh, wow. Yep, so I dropped like four and this is ten liters. Yeah, it's close to... 12 to 14 liters, so. Yeah, that's going to be a good amount. That's good. Drop 9 liters there. Leave us with a decent amount there. Um, I'm ready to get some sleep. I know it's going to be... It's going to be midday by the time we get up. 1% chance of risk. Risk of uh, intestinal parasites, so 1% chance. All right, um, then get something to drink here, and then we need some rest. She desperately needs that. Uh, I know our conditions dropped a little bit because of the hunger and the fatigue, but uh, we'll be just fine. We're just going to go ahead and rest for a good uh, 12 hours. See you all in the morning. Should be completely healed by the time we wake up, I think. Ah, yes, very nice. Let's get a drink straight away. Wakes up very thirsty. 67 days, 10 hours, and 20 minutes. That was close. I dropped him kind of close. All right, so she's still a little hungry here. Sounds like the blizzard has passed. And, uh, yeah, we got plenty of water now. So let's go ahead and eat something and then um, do a little studying here. And let's do it outside if the weather's decent. Might as well less than the chance of uh, cabin feet. Ooh, it's pretty out here. It's beautiful. I'm just going to get low here and stay up here on the porch. If we need to, we can just, boom, get right in the front door if anything nasty comes along. I, I don't think anything really does around here, but I don't know. You never know what these little, maybe some sort of little hot fix that slips something in. Just to get me. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, we'll do two hours for sure. And that should level us up. Oh, look at this. It's already about to be nightfall. <laughs> we should hear the... Ah. Right? It didn't do it. Do we not level up? I thought we leveled up. Okay. Mending. We're so close. Uh, it, it looked like it was filled in. What's the deal there? Did I not read that whole book? I thought I read the whole book. Gotta read more. Oh, come on. I gotta read another five hours worth? I don't wanna do that. That doesn't seem like fun. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. We're just maintaining our body temperature right now. Okay, fair enough. So, I'm gonna read here for another 
hour. Let's do two hours. See if we can make that before oh, nightfall. So yes. Yeah, that's very pretty. Very pretty sunset. So she's starting to get hungry. Rancid bear meat. That's okay. We can bring that back to life. Rune. Venison. Gamey. It's just a little gamey. Alright, so. She's not really that tired. Kind of think maybe we should start a little fire here and do some cooking. Cook up some of this meat, but I don't think we're going to be eating it right away. Uh, don't really want to eat this either. What do I want to do? Hmm, decisions. I guess we could just start a little fire and have some venison. 900 calories, sure. Alright, let's just do a couple of these back here. And, uh, I know it was sunny. I don't know if we still get the benefit of the sun right now. Maybe we do. Let's try it. Yeah, let's try it. Let's try starting a fire with the old, uh, nope, 0% chance. Okay. Well, let me go grab some. I think we have one. I'm just going to use some of these sticks. There should be plenty. Plenty of sticks. A weird haze over the, uh, over the water there, or over the, uh, lake. It's not really, well, it is water, it's just frozen. Okay, let's try to do the old, uh, torch trick here again. It's at 10% now, but, uh, should still work just fine. Alright, I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna start this one up because it's the best protected, I think. Oh, 32 sticks. We definitely have enough fuel to cook up some meat. I might do a few pieces of this deer, and I can switch between... Oh, that didn't work, see? Let's try again. I can switch between deer meat on one day and then bear meat the next day, deer meat, and go back and forth and kind of keep my risk at 1% the whole time rather than you know, eat two pieces of bear meat and then have it drop off or get up to 4%, and that would... Not be, the, oh, yeah. not be the best. That's a good one. I've gotten sick. I've gotten parasites from 4% risk, so a little paranoid about that. Once bitten, twice shy. Once infected, twice shy in that case. Alright, there should be plenty. Plenty. And I know, I, I could... I could spread the fire out on these and, and like decrease the time significantly, but I'm in no rush because she's not even close to being tired. So let's just throw these down. I could go get the pots and cook these faster, but again, I'm not in a huge rush. There we go. 45 minutes until ready. We do. Can we maybe bust up some wood or something? Make ourselves useful. I don't know. Maybe there'll be some wood back here. Let's go. Let's go check. Is that a piece of wood? No, it's a snow. That's yeah, that's snow. I'm looking for a big limb. Let's get the pistol out just in case we need to. Oh, I thought that was a I thought that was a wolf with antlers. Apparently. It's like that's terrifying. Alright, let's bust this down. Head back. Grab some sticks, because you know, 32 sticks wasn't enough. I'm not sure I can carry much more. All right, our meat should be cooked, and that's such a pretty sight right there. Looks like my cabin's on fire. It's a good way to catch my cabin on fire. That'd be horrible, wouldn't it? Yeah, that's a really good way to. You want to hop on the fire for me? That's the deer. Don't worry, folks. Is that all I had? I want to cook more than that. Here, let me get some more on there. Good sized ones. That's what I want. Nine, two, couple 900 calorie sized steaks. Alright. Then I'll drop my wood out front there. Oops. Alright, there we go. 
Uh, where, where do I want to put these? That'll work. Good enough. I kind of think I should eat something and study, but it's going to... An hour of studying is going to probably burn these steaks, so that's not going to happen. Yeah, let's just pass time till these are ready. Shouldn't be too much longer. A couple seconds. There we go. Alright, I'm pretty happy with that. We got a decent amount. How much, how much time we got left here? So hungry. Yeah, yeah, we'll do another one. We'll do another pair here. So let's do that real quick. Oh, that's a, that's a small stake. We don't want that one. 900. 900. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, that should do it for us. I'll be happy once we're done with this. And I'm, I'm guessing we'll probably go to bed. I don't know. Maybe around. Probably around the 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock position for the moon. Otherwise, she's not going to sleep through the night. She's not going to be worth a darn in the morning. Okay. All right. Well, I'll just let that burn out. You know, an unattended campfire right up next to a old cabin. Wood, you yeah, know, log cabin. What's what's the worst that could happen? Actually, I'm carrying two of those sticks. I want to drop one of them out here. So it stays a little... Doesn't decay as quick. Do that real quick. I'll just drop that one. That'll be fine. So, go inside. Pass a couple hours of time in bed. And then uh, study tomorrow. I'm really surprised we didn't level up. It was so close. Here, uh, let's just pass maybe three hours worth of time. That should be good. All right, I interrupted there. No, we got a little bonus. We got some bonus calories due to our cooking skill. There, it's nine sixty rather than nine hundred. I'll take it. And there should be no ill effects from that. And hopefully tomorrow we'll get rid of the risk for intestinal parasites. But first, I need to drink something. There we go. Let's sleep for about six or seven hours. I'm guessing it, we'll try for eight, but I think we're going to wake, wake up fully rested. Have some calories left over, which will be fine. Woke up fully rested, yeah. All right, time, time to do some study, and we're in good shape to study. So let's see if we can knock out five hours worth of studying. We're going to definitely need to eat something about halfway through our cram session here. All right, let's use it. Oh, maybe not, because we already have two hours done. I forgot about that. All right, let's do two hours here. I need to find food. All right, can I do one hour? Ah, yeah, we can get one hour in. Should have studied outside, but too late now. Now it's a blizzard. I'm not going out in that. Level up. There it is. That's what. That's the sound I was waiting for. All right, now let's take a look at our mending skill here. That's what I was looking for. Seventy-five percent chance of successful repair. Repair time decreased by fifteen. Ten percent greater item condition increase. All right. Well, 
let's um let's eat something here I have anything I don't want to eat my cattails if I don't have to which I don't have to I'll go eat one of these venison steaks just just cuz just because ooh ooh it's cold out here it's rather unpleasant I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to uh, repair it back here. Yeah, we should be fine here. Okay, let's uh, try to do our repair here. Okay, I'm nervous about this because this is a valuable material that I'm using. I need two cured guts. Okay, we definitely have those. No problem. Dip in here. Actually, I'll just, I'll just do it inside. I'm outside enough. It doesn't matter. I don't. Well. You know what, let's just, if we can do it outside, let's do it. It's best practice, right? All right, let's try it. Let's try it. An hour, 42 minutes. I really don't want to do that if I have to interrupt because I'm dying of hypothermia or, or catch hypothermia. I didn't realize it was going to take that long. And does it matter if I have quality tools? I don't, I don't think you even need tools for this. But if I'm going to pick up the tools, like, I don't think you need it, do you? No. Seeing. Chance of success is 95%. I really like that. Okay, guys, fingers crossed. I have pocket rockets I don't want to get drawn out on. Lose it on the river. Let's see what happens. Yes! 92% bear coat. Now, I'm not going to go get the other bear hide. And, re and use an entire bear hide just to get 8%. That would be such a waste. So, yeah, happy with that. Very happy with that. And what else can we repair? 65% on the gloves. And we need, what, uh, cured leather? We have some of that upstairs sitting on top of the uh, refrigerator, I think, or the cupboard or whatever it's called. Let's go do that. Let's go get that. All right, it's all about getting things back in good condition in this episode it looks like so yeah some leather right here yeah we can use that okay am I even wearing yeah I am wearing those okay I just want to make sure I was actually wearing those because I've been repairing stuff that I don't even wear like this hat right here you think I could switch it out for this hat I can do that wait can I put it on I got 74 and 96 well dude put on that one there we go Wait a minute. I put on the wrong one. Stand by. There we go. Much better. 99, 96, 75, 99, 74. Those need repaired. 99, 99, 73. Once that gets down to about 55, I'll repair these. 65. We can definitely repair those. Everything's in pretty good condition, man. I'm I'm happy with it. I'm happy. Uh, except for the gloves. I want to repair those. So let's uh, let's repair these. Ninety-five percent chance of success. I like I love those odds, man. <gasps> oh, I'm so glad that didn't happen with the bear hide. I'd be so upset. Cured leather, yeah, it's, it's not great, but <laughs> it could be way worse, right? Because you know we got like twelve cured leather over here. <laughs> Holy cow! 95% chance. That was a 5% chance of failure right there, and it, and it happened. All right, let's do it again. All right, there we go. We got it that time. Right. Oh, I'm so glad it didn't happen with the bear hide. Oh, I'd be so mad. I mean, I know we have the other bear hide at the unnamed uh, cabin, but I think we do. Unless that was the one we brought back. I can't remember now. It was so many episodes ago, I can't remember. Alright, so. Let me try losing a little bit of weight here. Um, I'm done with these books. I don't need these anymore. So we can just like... Uh, is this one? Yeah, we're just putting all our sewing, sewing primer books right here. I've read a lot of those, apparently. I think I'll... Uh, <clears throat> sorry, my, I don't know what it is. Got... I think it might just be allergies. Okay. Uh, fishing. How's our... Our fishing's got to be pretty low. Hold on. Sorry. I exited right where I needed to be. 
it's a level two. Um, wait, no, it isn't. It's level, yeah, there we go, level two. Fishing time reduced by five, eight percent chance of line break on catch. So, let's, uh, let's study up on some fishing while we have, uh, good stats right now. See if we can maybe finish that book out. Because I would like to do some, uh, some ice fishing as well. Let's try to knock out two hours here. Let's see where we're at. Oh no! Oh, I got cabin fever. I should have been studying outside. I'm an. Oh, I have been spending a lot of time inside. I should. I should have saw that coming. All right, cabin fever. You've been indoor so long, you're starting to feel very uneasy. Spend some time outdoors before it gets worse. Yeah. Spend some time in the uh, blizzard. Why don't you? All right, we'll go out there and and read the book. It shouldn't be that bad actually. As long as we're behind a hardcover, we should be. Nope, that's not hardcover. That's like the worst place to be. Here, go stand over here. That's a pretty good spot right there. I think we're protected from almost every angle. Maybe not here. I don't know if those rocks, those rocks probably aren't close enough. But uh, it actually feels like 10 degrees Celsius back here. So we're warming up. All right, let's do some more reading. Let's see where we're at here. 27%. And the way that works, it fluctuates really weird. Like, it'll go down, you'll be outside, then it'll go back up again. I don't... I can't... I can't remember what it is, but it does weird stuff. So basically just try to stay outside as much as you can until it's gone. Otherwise, if you get cabin fever, you can't sleep indoors. Like, you cannot do it. It's weird. Like I said, weird. And it's nice and beautiful outside. It's probably super warm. 27% still. Well, heck, we'll just stay outside tonight. If we can, we'll just camp out right here. Shouldn't be that big a deal. Alright. Oh, I should have drank something. I barely got it done. <laughs> that was really risky. Oh, don't drink your tea. Don't drink your tea. I thought you had water up there. That was just me just clicking super fast. Forgetting. I wish now I wish they would stay where they were before. I wish it wouldn't rotate around on the radio wheel. Sorry, I should get out the uh, lantern here. There we go. There we go. All right. I if I can drop or I could just slow down and pay attention. That that would be another solution to that problem. Try and get out of here as fast as I can. <laughs> Pen penalized for being in indoors. And nothing to drink. Okay. So there we go. We could always stay in a fishing hut if we wanted to. Could do that. Am I carrying around anything stinky? I think so. Alright, let's get a drink now. I think we'll go stay in the fishing hut. That counts as outdoors, so. Um, yeah, that'll be fun. Fun place to camp out. Um, are I ready to go to bed yet? Mm, probably not, but, uh... Yeah, let's just head down there. Didn't catch where that was coming from. What is our temp out here? Nine degrees. Man, I could just sleep out here, actually. Until it gets bad. Then I might have to find somewhere else or start a fire or something. I have to go for the uh, fishing hut for the little potbelly stove in there. Yeah, I think we'll just hang out here for oh, a bit. I've never been so hungry in my life. Improve rest. I can't believe I did that. Let's see here. I got this. I got this. Start a fire if need be. I don't know why I'm carrying that. Drop that. And this. Uh, I got some reading material. This is actually no longer needed. Drop that. Fire starting will go up quite a bit if I read that one. But we don't have enough time. So. I do have some food with me. How much is this torch? 
Oh, it's only 5%. I'm going to leave that behind. Oh, this one is probably pretty low as well. It might be burnout. Yeah, it is. It's burnout. Um, do I have any fishing gear with me? Might actually do some ice fishing. It didn't level up. That's the only thing. Yeah. Didn't even... Just went up just a little bit. Uh, let me see here. Check. I have a hook. I need some line. I don't think I need a workbench to make it do. Oh, yeah, I do, don't I? Yeah, and I don't want to spend time inside. Fishing tackle. There it is. Uh, yeah, I know it's 10 minutes, but. All right, let's just, let's just head down here and hang out. In case we need the fire, we have it right there. We're good to go. In case it gets real cold out here and I don't have to walk through a blizzard to try to find a fishing hut in the middle of a, you know, where the wolves like to patrol. So, let's just go ahead and do it now. Move, move down this way. I'm a little worried that I'm going to pull one of them because I am carrying a stake. There's one over there. Right, uh, right there. Make that two. Might eat my stake now, actually. Because even though I don't have stink lines, they are... willing to come over and cause problems. It looks like they're deploying for the night. Alright, I'm going to try to run past them. Right, I'd like one with a door, but I can't remember if any of these have doors. Yeah, let's go find one with a door. Why is she breathing so heavy? Oh, encumbered. That's why. I think it's the furthest one down, actually. Maybe this one's the one with the door, is it? Yeah, I think it's the furthest one down. And the bear's out, it looks like. I think that's the bear over there. Yep. Yep, that's him. He's meandering. And this one has a... This one has a door. Perfect. I'll take it. Can't remember if that one has a door. Nope, this one does not have a door. Oh well, I'd rather hang out around the bear, sleep around the bear, than uh, the wolves. So, the bear will help keep the wolves away. Do none of these have a door? They none of them do, do they? Oh well, we'll take this one. We'll 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 what, rent this room over here in Bearville for the night. Wait, is that what it, it does have a door. It does. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Hey, bear. Alright. This is our home for the night. What we got in here? Nothing much. Nothing much. I'm looking to see if I missed any fishing tackle. Uh, nothing. Okay. Well, in that case, I think we're pretty tired. This should do us pretty well. How is our cabin fever doing? Oh, see, it's up to 28. We've been outside this whole time. It's like up to 28 now. It's weird. I don't understand the, that's a, such a weird mechanic, the way it's implemented. Makes no sense. All right. And I have, yeah, plenty of water. I should check before I left. Our bedroll. Oh, we can also repair our bedroll eventually, too. What I really need to do is make a bear roll. That's the best. It's the cat's meow right there. But uh, in the meantime, well, we got plenty of calories. Let's get ourselves a little something to drink. And yeah, we'll have a good night's sleep. Should be good. I'm just going to rest, like, probably three hours at a time. And if things get bad, we can fire up the... The, the little potbelly stove here. We got a few 
I got, we got four pieces of coal and some wood. We should be good. If not, we're not too far away from the house if we have to stay inside. If it's like a horrible day. So, all right, let's go ahead and get some sleep. See you guys in three hours. Ooh. How are we doing in here? Improve rest. I forgot I had that going on. Yeah, it's still good. And we're getting a little bit of a bonus here. We're getting another 3.8 degrees. So when we're in, inside our bag, it's, it feels like 10.8 degrees Celsius. Let's do it again. Starting to get nasty out there. That's what these cabins were built for, though. 68 days, 22 hours, 21 minutos. 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 Uh, I'm just making up words now. Down to three degrees in here. We'll sleep for just two this time. Still doing good with our temperature. And it's still it's getting colder though. It is getting colder. Alright. Sun is gonna be coming up here soon though, so You woke up fully rested. Of course I did. That was really quick. Right. Well, let's just rest here in the in the bedroll. Yeah. Starting to get. Oh, now the temperature's starting to go up now. Made it, through. Made it through another night. That's right. You sure did. Oh, I'm starving. Oh, you're okay. Okay, let's take a look here at our, what am I doing? Oh, it's gone. Cabin fever risk is gone. Could come back pretty quick though, so I'll, I kind of want to stay outside as much as I can at the moment for the next mm, couple days just to try to lower the overall average, I think, of time inside. I don't know exactly how it's calculated, so is he still wandering around the side? Yep, he is. This is his area, man. He loves this area. It's such a weird morning. It's pretty. It's weird. Hey, buddy. All right, guys. I'm gonna end this episode here. Ooh. I'm gonna end it. Nope. Not quite there. I'm gonna end the episode here. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. Y'all take care.